And Donald Trump, you know, he's not a judicial guy. He's not a, he's not a guy who goes to a lot of Federalist Society meetings. He's a guy who listens to the experts. And the experts were these Federalist Society guys, and they said, hey, here's a list of 25 great conservatives. Pick. And Donald Trump said, okay, mm, boom, Neil Gorsuch, boom, and what a home run. This guy was fantastic, an intellectual powerhouse, a voice for conservatism, conservatism a voice for freedom, a great pick. Now we've got a chance to do another. Wall Street Journal just came out today and said, here are the three headliners. Guy named Raymond Kethledge, uh, Amy Cohen Barrett, and Brett Kavanaugh. And you know what? Holy cow. We are in an enviable position, people, as conservatives. We are in the enviable position of having to choose between you know, a 95%, a 96%, maybe a 98% selection. I mean, it's that good. We can't lose on any of this. The big question is, can we do better? Because nobody has agreed on who it should be you know, in the conservative movement. Let's look at the candidates. Uh, Kethledge is from Michigan. Michigan's a swing state. That's useful. Remember, these things have political resonation. This gets the base out, and you know, if you're, somebody's from your state and they get appointed, well, you kind of want them to win because you know you're patriotic. That's kind of patriotic, except for states. Anyway, uh, Kethledge is an outdoorsman, but more important, he is not an Ivy Leaguer. He went to the University of Michigan undergrad and graduate. Why is that important? Because every single judge or justice on the Supreme Court is an Ivy League grad. They either went to Harvard or they went to Yale. Can you believe that? It's insane. It, it, you know, the most, arguably, the, 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 the most important nine unelected people in the country. And they all come out of the same little bubble. How about some diversity? <gasps> Whoa! Did I go there? I went there. Let's get some diversity.